All right, welcome to Inside Freeport Ninja, a new series hosted by me, Ryan Krause, AKA Coach Rye. In this series, I'll show you behind the scenes footage of Freeport Ninja Academy and give interviews with kids, adults, and even your favorite coaches. Before we start, make sure to like and subscribe for more and follow all of our social media linked in the description below. So earlier today, we had a camp outing visit. How camp outings work is that we do obstacles with them and then we do relay races at the end of all the obstacles that they did. Let's take a look at this week's camp outings. All right, so I am here with Alex Breitenstein, AKA Coach Alex. Yes. So tell me, Alex, how long have you been coaching at Freeport Ninja Academy? Um, I've been coaching at Freeport Ninja Academy for about almost a year now, but I've been doing Ninja for almost three years at this point. Tell me a little about your background. Background, um, I just decided one day, hey, this sport looks cool, let me give it a try. Started coming here for our adult nights, which are Monday and Wednesday nights. Shameless so plug. I know. Um, so I started coming there, got really good, and I realized, hey, maybe I should start coaching, teaching kids, feel like it's a fun job, and here I am today. And what's your favorite part about coaching? I would definitely say my favorite part about coaching is watching just the kids get better at all these obstacles, just seeing like them improve from one turn to the next, and just seeing how excited they get for all the obstacles we do every week. And what's your favorite obstacle to teach and why? You know, I thought about this one actually, and my favorite obstacle to teach is definitely on prees. It's very um, fun to just, it's very simple to teach, but it's also very um, rewarding because a lot of the kids can see their improvement just by like, very simple to teach them. And it's also very rewarding when you get to see them make it because a lot of them do improve on prees. Can you explain what a pre is? A pre is when you kind of run across something and then you jump and land and try to precision land on like something small like maybe like a stride or a bounce bar or whatever. All right. Yeah. Now you set up a lot of these obstacles every week. Can I you, do, yes. Can you talk a little about what goes into setting them up? Yeah, sure. So every week we have four different obstacles. We rotate them by the week. And um, it depends. It's just like some obstacles are very simple. Like maybe like the rock wall, for example, you just hit them at it. But maybe something like um, advanced ring swing. You gotta put up like a bunch of rings, different types of rings. That has a lot of thought. So it depends on the week and week. Sometimes it takes like... 15 minutes if it's an easy week, but some weeks it takes about, you know, two hours seeing what obstacles we got. And, um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of experience. I've always worked with tools in my life, and it's fun to use them with something I love. All right. Now, talk to me a little about training and competing. Ooh, training and competing. Um, it's definitely fun. I get to stay here late at night, get a lot of training time in, however long I want, which is very fun. Um, competing is super fun as well. I get to go to all sorts of different competitions like WNLs 
doing some NSN this year. Um, a lot of fun to do. Get, get to see myself improve by every single year, get better and better and better. I'm actually going to be moving up into a division next year, so I'm going to be competing against much harder people. So it's definitely a lot of fun competing. It can be stressful, but at the same time, you got to put your A game on when it comes to the line. Absolutely. And do you think we'll see you on American Ninja Warrior someday? I think for sure you'll see me on American Ninja Warrior someday. All right, can't wait. Thank can't you very much. Of course. All right, so I'm here with Amaya. And Amaya, how long have you been coming to Freeport Ninja Academy? Uh, probably, <laughs> I don't know. You don't know? All right. And what's your favorite obstacle and why? Um, my favorite obstacle is work tomorrow because we can run up and touch the buzzer. All right, sounds good. Uh, how old are you, Amaya? Six. Six. And what do you like to do besides Ninja? Uh, paint. I like to paint besides Ninja. Anything else? Uh, um, I like to um, draw, paint, and um, dance. Draw, paint, and dance. All right. And what's your favorite food and why? Um, my favorite food is pizza and because And do you think we'll see you on American Ninja Warrior someday? Yeah. Yeah? All right, thank you very much. Amaya, are you smart? Yes! It's cold! Apparently, I've never been on live TV before. All I want to do is stay home and eat chips. And interview kids, adults, and your favorite. Say, apparently I've never been on live television before. <laughs> what? Apparently I've never been on live television before. Say that one more time. <laughs> apparently I've never been on live stop, television before. Stop, stop slow. Apparently. All right, so I'm here with Alex Breitenstein. You said it wrong. <laughs> Breitenstein. But that's what I said. So you said Brett. It sounded like Breitenstein. Right. Breitenstein. All right, so I'm here with Alex. Okay, wait. <laughs> bright, bright, and and stun. Think stunned. of the word bright, like a bright That's light. What I said. No, you said bread. You said like bread, like the name, right. like bright, and then. And okay, you got it. Right, so you got it. <laughs> Thanks for watching, subscribe.